six-month jail term and a stiff fine, but as our John Marshall reports, the sentence went down much lighter. It was on Santa Monica Boulevard late on a Saturday night three months ago. Dean Martin's Rolls Royce was pulled over by a highway patrolman who thought he spotted a drunk driver. The driver was not drunk, but he did carry a loaded 38 in a small holster in his boot. Today, at the Beverly Hills Courthouse, the 65-year-old entertainer told reporters he had carried the weapon for years for protection. Martin said he bought it after several incidents involving total strangers who came up to him in restaurants, incidents he considered to be life-threatening. Still, before municipal judge Andrew Weiss, Martin all but admitted he had broken the law. He and his attorney entered a plea of nolo contendere, no contest to a concealed weapons charge. In a deal worked out with a prosecutor, Martin in return would not have to serve time in jail, and a second count of carrying a loaded weapon would be dropped altogether. The judge did place Martin on probation for a year and imposed a $120 fine. Outside the courtroom, Martin told news people he had learned his lesson. I was just ignorant of the law. I didn't know that you weren't allowed to have a gun in the car. I also didn't know you weren't allowed to have a gun at your home. Will you try for a concealed weapon permit now that you know what the law is and still carry the weapon but with a permit? No, I wouldn't carry a gun at all, with or without a permit. Why do you feel the need to carry a gun? Well, for your own protection. I mean, you, we go out at night, I mean, think everybody should carry a gun? No, 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 just me. <laughs> so Dean Martin says he'll never carry a gun on the street again. Will he keep a weapon at home? Oh, yes, he told us, a seven iron. John Marshall, News 4, Beverly Hills.